welcome now we will discuss the earlier lectures we have seen different types of temperature sensors now we will discuss some pressure sensors now what is pressure pressure is force per unit area and there are different types of pressure sensors first of all we will see a category called elastic members so this what are the types of elastic members we will see first type is uh, first type of pressure sensors we have categorized that is first type is elastic members so the elastic members are generally used for measurement of the pressure up to about 700 megapascal again there are different ranges for this but it is normally that now this elastic members are of different types first type is burden tube burden tube So everything um, I will not try it. You, I have already provided you can notes. So these burden tubes are of different shapes and also having different cross sectional areas like uh, circular or rectangular in this way. Okay. So these burden tube are having different types like C type, C type burden tube then spiral type then twisted tube type and uh, last one is helical type C type spiral type twisted tube type and then helical type now uh, it is not the uh, final construction just I, I, I will show you the shape of the C type burden tube this is this is like C of alphabet so it is called a C type burden tube and it is connected through some joints Union joints and this may be connected to a pointer and it may be like this. So in the scale it is analog type of C type burden tube. So it is fixed at this area and the pressure will be applied here p pressure will be applied here and as soon as this pressure will insert to the c type burden tube uh, this tip will deflect in this way accordingly using this gear and gear technology this pointer will move in this direction if if it moves in this direction it will move in this direction if it moves in this direction it will move in this direction so it will show you the uh, pressure what is the pressure of the this thing so it may be connected to a tube like your uh, bicycle or uh, motorbike huh? bikes are there so that tube this suppose this is a tube in inside this I want to measure the pressure so I will connect it with this okay so this inside pressure will be inserted inside this and accordingly you will get the output so we will not see the applications right now just try to understand that if there is a closed uh, loop is there and i have applied some pressure then there will be a deflection of the tip and accordingly you will get the output so this is all about this c type burden tube next we will see what is the spiral type burden tube so in spiral type it is having this type of structure again my 
drawing is not proper but you can understand what I am trying to convey okay again here also this is fixed and this is the spiral and the pointer will be connected to this and as soon as we apply the pressure the pointer will move and it will show you the reading of the pressure okay again i am telling it is a analog okay again i will show you how to convert it to electrical that is the next step so it is called the spiral type burden tube see the shape of this it is it is of spiral nature is spiral so it is called a spiral type burden tube next we will try to see the type twisted tube type twisted tube type burden tube this twisted tube type is actually the shape is rectangular okay now this is the shape So this is a 3D diagram so from here the actually the pressure will be applied so actually this is a structure okay so inside this the pressure is there this pressure will be inserted this and this will this will rotate like this so this will rotate like this this tube will be twisted so it is it is called twisted tube type uh, burden tube so it is twisted actually as you can see here it is twisted when the pressure will ins insert it will try to move in this direction it will try to normalize its effect of the twist it is called a twisted type burden tube next one is helical type burden tube next type is helical type burden tube so this helical type is like this one second So this is called helical helical type okay now you see So its shape is like helical, helical shape is there when the pressure is inserted. Okay, this will deflect, this pointer will deflect. It is a 3D figure, try to understand. Then this helical will deflect in this way. So it is also a kind of burden tube. So all those uh, type C type, spiral type, twisted type, helical type, these are comes under burden tube and burden tube comes under elastic members. 
so this is all about burden tube okay in the next lecture we will see what are the design considerations okay thank you